How's it going, Professor McLaughlin? Uh, just want to say thank you for being such an approachable teacher, easy to talk to and stuff. So here we go. My name is Toby Gaines. I'm a student in the Eco Lit class. This is my 54th take for the informal reflection vlog. Many things have happened over the course of the semester. From awkward silence because no one knew what to say because they were all too tired from being hung over at the bars the previous night. From listening to random girls talk about supposedly controversial topics that I've never heard of before. That was kind of interesting. Um, I definitely have 100% grown as a as a reader this semester because of the sheer volume I had to read, not only in this class, but I mean, I had three other classes with about the same amount of books. I probably spent like 550 bucks on books. So yeah, I had about two or three books per week. It's a lot of reading, I'm not really much of a reader. So yeah, definitely, definitely made me improve. I learned a lot of vocab I've never heard before, but you always corrected me in class. Um, some of the books I've had to read this semester are Wise Blood by Flannery O'Connor, Beautiful World in your class. I've had to read the Quran, lots of the Bible, some pieces of the Torah, Beowulf, the Four Loves, and Gun Island. Favorite book of the year is probably the Quran, just because it was, I mean, it's a religious book, and I thought it was a little bit, like, different because it was more of a story rather than just teachings. I know it wasn't in your class, but I mean, I liked it. Um, I've also written a crazy amount, which is good, bad in the moment. I had to reread text because you would talk about it in class and I'd be completely lost on what I'd read before. So time consuming, but I don't regret it help me because I mean I had to reread some of my essays to make sure it's what I wanted to say and it didn't sound like I didn't say it um one fun memory was uh talking about that uh Will Smith interaction at the Oscars where he slapped the shit out of Chris Rock that was pretty funny and you really had some valid opinions about it and all the girls in the class Really enjoyed how, I think there, there was like two days out of class where we just didn't even get to any of like the the readings that week because we were talking about the Will Smith. So it was nice. We just went to class, had good conversations, didn't even have to talk about anything besides the Will Smith. That was fun. And then also when, um, let's see, when Afro Man was supposed to perform and he didn't show up. We had some good talks about that, good theories on why he didn't show up, and some people said what that what actually happened. Uh, my critical thinking skills also improved since I had to break down quotes each week. <clears throat> Trying to relate certain topics to the text, all the difficult, definitely proved a good skill to learn for, I mean, obviously for your class and then in the in the future, I'm definitely going to have to do something like that. And then another fun memory was watching my friends and I struggle with the out loud reading in class because none of us are really advantageous readers. And so we just struggle with everything. And every time we stutter, we look at each other and make fun of each other. I thought it was a good time. Man, you were always there to correct us. Sometimes... Connor next to me, which is like, oh, I don't know that word. Keep going on. It's a good one. Um, I think uh, for future classes, the book list could become like more like college friendly. I mean, maybe it was just me because I don't read a lot. But like, so like we could be into it. I mean, it seemed like people, it's probably just because it was the morning. They were like a little bit like bored in class besides, besides for like some of the girls in the class. But just, um, I mean, obviously, it's got to relate to the topic, but just some things that would keep the keep the students more engaged. 
Uh, I thought the peer revisions, the like the papers that you read, read out with like the format, and, like different questions, proved effective. Because I mean, you get like a different pair of eyes, and then like just just like a bunch of different things that you can include in your paper that like aren't from you. Because I mean, if it's all from me, the paper's not going to be that good. So. Uh, starting off the classes with hot takes and uh, debating, and then you, yeah, starting off the class with hot takes and then de and then you debating them with if you thought the take was valid or not. I thought it was pretty good, good way to just start off the class, get everyone chilled out, and not stress. Uh, I had a good time in this class semester and felt like I grew as a reader. Writer, critical thinking obviously improved. And uh, I enjoyed hearing Cliff talk about his life story, even though it didn't pertain to stuff, but I mean, it was cool. I do wish that you answered emails a little bit more, but I'm um, very thankful and glad you're such an approachable teacher. So thank you for that. I hope I have you as a teacher again.